Hi guys, my name is Alex and my company Vega Security. We did this project in 2019. We installed access control, high vision cameras. This project had the uh, first high level cameras for 4K, 8 megapixel, and like they are still work super perfectly for all building needs. So far, as we are working a lot with Ubiquiti equipment, we had a chance to test a new, I would say, super unique panel, Ubiquiti a, a, a UA Intercom. Before New Year, we changed our very old Mircom panel, Mircom T3 Nano, with not, without touch screen, only for buttons and a lot of claims from the client. Change it to AI intercom uh, from Ubiquiti. This building has right now some like uh, nice improvements. First of all, we have this uh, new panel, intercom panel. Then we have high vision cameras connected with AI port and connected to the hub that managed by this intercom. We have we achieved a lot of interesting security features and we are happy that our client... Let's move forward. I will be glad to show you what is it and how it works. So from 2019, the client has this panel. You can compare. So no touch screen, only four buttons. And the biggest problem was to create a key hole for Canada Post. As you see here, Canada Post hole was a handmade created here and that works with access control based on the contact. So we did some updates. We changed because we know how the system works and how contact panel connected. It also has an Amazon connection so Amazon guys can go and enter into the building from their phones. And we changed the intercom panel to a new one. Literally changes for us took maybe 30 minutes. Um, like we prepared the wood plate, just a placeholder, but the cables and everything else uh, works perfectly. First part, it's a face plate. We did an update, we changed the panel, we connected it. Second part, we will see later, it's our electrical room where we have hub, where we have a dream machine and where we have also a AI port connected to the camera for megapixel camera here. So this is a base setup of the panel. We have our directory with all users, tenants. It's very important to think about how you would like to work with the residents. We have a special unique dial code that you can press and you can get this panel. Uh, you can get to this person from this panel or you can search by name or search by apartment number. We have also a feature for scan QR codes. So in case we have our um, service maintenance guys who are doing our like a building maintenance, they, have, they can have a QR code to get inside the building to do their job and this code will disappear when they finish. Uh, we have multiple options to use uh, to get access. You can simply press a pin code, for example, yep. And you can get inside the building. Uh, you can call by yourself from your application. Uh, you can use your NPC card on NPC phone. So one of the options is to use mobile application from Ubiquiti to open the door from your mobile phone or to have a video call with your visitor. So we go simply to directory and we search for the person. Then we have mobile application, opening. So we have this mobile application. And now we can go to see who is calling. Uh, we have multiple options to see, like to, to talk to the person and the call or unlock the door. So the door will be open now.
Also, we have a very nice feature for the face recognition. So you simply come to the panel, you smile, and the door will be open. Yeah. So for me, I think that probably this is the best panel ever we have since 2000s. We tried, we used, and we installed for the clients. So I'm not sure what about the other brands and what they will do, but ubiquity with a UAP intercom right now, maybe in two, three years, far away from all other products on the market. Also, as you know, um, your intercom and the hub have an option to connect to the, another camera. So what we did, we used an old 2019 uh, camera from Hike Vision, 4K 8 megapixel camera. And we connected this camera using AI port to exactly this intercom hub. Right now we can go to, as an admin to the panel, uh, the protect application. And when we have a case and uh, from access application, when we have a case to open something, we have two cameras managed, like we can see the video and we will show this video on my computer. Event, opening the door or event, calling resident. And this event has two video shootings at the same time, synchronized from AI camera and another camera. Also this camera right now, thankfully to AI port, as a face recognition because the camera is a 4K and high resolution. We can see people, our residents or not good people trying to get inside the building. Our next step will be to install AI Theta camera here on the face level with the face recognition and the siren and to get the database of not good people trying to get inside the building and have a sound alarm when they enter the lobby. So almost all our projects, uh, we are removing like old stuff and installing ubiquity equipment as well for the offers, office service. So also I would like to share this use case uh, using ubiquity in our multi-dwelling building. So first we have internet inside the garage for car chargers and communication so people can communicate inside the garage level. So we have our dream machine with access points and uh, Wi-Fi. Then we have our Wi-Fi inside the office for building administration purposes. Also we have Protect. Right now we have one Protect installed connected to the camera but soon we will switch all high vision cameras from the high vision video recorder to the um, ubiquity dream machines here you can see the whole events and uh, stories of all our people here we have a face recognition based on the 2019 high vision 8 megapixel 4k camera for example, yesterday we had this case with this person and this person came to the building and was waiting to someone let him know, let him enter. So you just simply can see this case. I will switch to high quality. So this person was sitting there and waiting for um, someone who can let him enter into the building. We would like to install AI Theta and the siren as well and we will register all bad persons in the system so this person will have a sound alarm entering into the lobby this will be our next project and i hope uh, oleg will join us <laughs> with uh, some video so here we have a list of all our people users tenants and you can see the list of uh, how many times each person and back and forth, back and forth in the building. Case manager, very interesting uh, feature. Uh, when we switched all our cameras to um, Ubiquiti, we will use uh, case manager to investigate all issues inside the building and building life. Very comfortable to look for the recording for the event here and to see like a different issues 
uh, to see different uh, footages for different problems we have managing this building. And the access, we have list of our tenants, we have our one device panel, we have our second device, our hub, we have managed like paired devices. You can see that the hub has two paired devices, high vision camera and office lobby um, system. It is connected to our contact system to manage people to upper, open the door. So literally it's very interesting solution all together. So welcome to one of our lovely places. Um, this is an installation we did in 2019. So as you see, we have contact access control boxes. We have um, 12 doors. We have the device for Amazon Arc ring. So the Amazon guys can go and enter to the building from their phones. Uh, and as well, we have different uh, power adapters for mug locks in the building. So this is installation, the access control for this multi-residential building. And this is how we are doing our installations. So here it's not finished because everything in demo production right now. Uh, as you see, after our installation of the Ubiquiti intercom, we bypassed connection to the intercom panel because please keep in mind that the intercom panel must have only one CAT6 cable, nothing else. So from the, from the installer perspective, this is very interesting and very comfortable to install all Ubiquiti equipment. Uh, from the wiring perspective, all access control, uh, from Ubiquiti you need to pass only CAT6 cable and that's all. No like usual readers, power, like a sensor uh, cables. So it's very, very comfortable to work with Ubiquiti as installers. Uh, here you see usual high vision video recorder. And this is a connection from our camera in the lobby and see here, this is Ubiquiti AI port. Uh, we did a temporary bypass from this camera and as you see two cables, this cable for intercom and this is a cable from the AI port that are going to the hub. So this is our new year gift, new year improvement for our building. And here you can see dream machine. We have fiber input directly from the internet service provider connection. So we are not using any internet service provider modems or routers. So we are going directly to our dream machines. And this dream machine supply internet for all the building. And there we have our hub. And on the hub we see uh, one connection that goes to contact panel. This is our intercom connection and this is a port camera in the lobby. So we have our dry contact for the uh, lock, uh, dry loop, and we have also PoE2 plus uh, power adapter that fit the whole system. Uh, two cameras, a port and the intercom panel. So everything is here. Everything works here. Also, don't forget to use power backups. We have here our red line generator power. We have UPS and the whole system, all controllers and all stuff we have with generator and the battery backup. So my name is Alex. Uh, my company has a name Vega Security. Uh, we are doing this business more than 20 years. Uh, here in Canada, we serve uh, Quebec and Montreal area uh, with all access control and the cameras, um, internet and different IT systems. We are working with like different companies. We are partners and the certified installers for almost all brands um, in Canada. We have a great team and we're glad to serve our 
lovely clients for multi-residential buildings, residential buildings uh, for all needs, starting from the ground level, starting from the like uh, beginning of the project and finishing to uh, to train or to, to teach all building managers. Uh, we provide up to five years warranty on all our uh, labor and the equipment and clients are very very happy working with us and uh, almost all our projects based on the recommendations. Thank you for watching. I hope my use case will be very useful for you and we'll be glad to answer your, all your questions. You can find me on our website and contact us on our website vega-security.com. Um, thank you so much and don't forget to subscribe to People Systems channel.